hey guys so today i'm gonna be filming as you can see from the title what's in my purse video so i've been wanting to do this video for a while and i just felt like it might be kind of boring but i do have a lot of girls that did request it and i personally when i watch youtube videos these are the kind of videos i watch like room tour apartment tour what's in my purse what's on my iphone like i'm just nosy so i like seeing like people's lives and what they do um and i'm just girly so stuff like this you get ideas on what to keep in your bag and vice versa so i was like let me just finally film this video because i use my purse every day the content really doesn't change so so let me just go ahead just got back home um so this is my favorite purse at the moment it's like a vintage fendi purse it's gold sparkly i'll kind of try to show you details super cute i got this off of like either the real real or rebag one of those sites that sell like vintage secondhand purses um because they have like all the one of a kind ones like this is not something you're gonna find in the store and i don't even know what this would be called but i'm sure if you just typed in the description of it you could find it and i got it for a good price i want to say like i paid less than a thousand i think actually i might be wrong it was either a little over a thousand or like right under but it was worth it and it looks little i'm into little mini bags i don't like carrying a huge bag because i just go a million places um this is little but it carries a lot it fits a lot like i have this packed so yeah and i love the little locket detail i don't really have any other fendi um items i have like a fendi vest but no more purses or anything so super cute and this surprisingly matches with a lot i wear this purse so much it's like my everyday bag so we're just gonna go ahead and get started on what's in it before we go to exactly what's in it of course i always have my phone on me i just have my phone i have if i'm not holding it obviously it's in my bag so this is just the 12 pro you can see that super cute matches my nails another thing i usually keep in my bag but these are just out of it right now because i just got home so it was just in my hand is my keys and if i am carrying a bag that's smaller and i can't fit it i'll just take off my airpods or i'll take off um my fob because this is what opens my door i don't use the actual key the key that i have on here is for my mail so this is my little key ring i have my airpods on here because if i don't i will lose them and y'all guess which number of airpods this is i'm gonna let you guess take a second comment below all right this is my sixth pair of airpods literally and i know that seems so stupid like why do you keep buying them but and yes i did add the tracking last couple times then i switched phones and it just didn't work out so if it's not connected to this i legit will lose it like anytime it hasn't been on here i've lost it but what's funny is the last time i had this i still lost it because I was rushing out and I had one in my ear and this was open so like it fell out and usually it stays intact because they're like magnetic but it fell out that one time so yeah um have a little Paris keychain I have this little I forgot the name of this character she's so dirty though not it's not Hello Kitty but it's like Sanrio still I think so this little bunny character if you know the name comment below because I can't remember the name but I love these um have my fob for my door also it comes with like a little mushroom then i have my airpods of course i just have the regular ones i don't bother getting new airpods i don't remember what they're called but the ones that are shaped a little different and they're like you can't hear anything else background noises because i lose them so much and i just like them because they're handy and you just pop them in your ear i don't really care about like the extra features so yeah my airpods are in here i got this little case from amazon then have a little pepper spray i never carried like any kind of protection or pepper spray but then my boyfriend got this for me because i'm just always going places and crazy things happen to me so he was like you need a pepper spray so he just gave me one i put it on my key so anyone wants to mess with me you're gonna get sprayed <laughs> legit i'd be the type to spray myself trying to open this shit but it's just good to have um if i'm ever like walking alone at night i'll just have this open or when i was walking my dog and stuff i'll just keep it in my hand last two things before i actually get into what's in my actual purse 
um because i'll usually be wearing this but like i said if i'm if it's not on me it's going to be in my bag so i'll always keep a pair of sunglasses if i'm going to be out and about for like the whole day so these are my two favorites that i switch between this one is they're just some gucci really big oversized sunglasses super cute i have these in pink as well pink and a regular black but these are my favorites because they're just super sparkly and cute love them um and then the other pair actually they're not these are not my other favorite but these are just some new ones i got that i brought today while i was out because i thought they would match with one of my outfits but i ended up not wearing it um so they're just some white sunglasses from saint laurent and this is how they look and yeah my other favorite ones are black ones same shape but they're dior and they're in my closet but i'm not going to show you just because those weren't the ones i used today and i don't have that many sunglasses i want to actually start collecting a good like collection of them because i need to get into accessories more that's one of my goals for this year start accessorizing invest in jewelry and glasses and shoes and more bags like it's one of my little like materialistic goals to just up my game in accessories and shoes so yeah now we have the purse so i'm just gonna open her up all right so this little bag is stuffed to the max um the first thing i have in here that i'm just gonna pull out is baby wipes so i'm the type of person i keep baby wipes with me at all times you just never know when you're gonna need baby wipes whether it be just to like wipe up a mess or i don't know just using the bathroom like i like to be fresh so especially if you're on your time of the month and you're running around all day these are a must along with like feminine products i don't currently have any feminine products in my bag just because i'm not on my cycle right now but ideally if it's around that time i'll definitely have like a tampon or two in here um especially if i'm gonna be out the whole day you need that so yeah i just have some baby wipes just never know but they help a lot of situations so there's that all right next thing that i have is my invisalign case so a lot of you guys say i have a lisp now and that's because i have invisalign if you can see it i don't know you can't really tell because it's clear but my invisalign case i keep this in my bag because anytime i eat drink or do anything i have to take it out and i don't want to just throw it anywhere so i have a case for it. it really needs to be cleaned right now i need to like wash this um yeah just put it in here close it that's my case all right next thing i have is a hand sanitizer i actually have a few hand sanitizing products in here this one is by the brand poopery and it's coconut and lavender i'm gonna put some on right now because it just smells good it smells yummy but um this is like a bougie hand sanitizer the only reason i got this is because i like this brand they sell the little poopery things that you keep on your toilet or you can keep it in your bag as well and basically anytime you poop you spray the poopery in the toilet three times and then you do your business and you will not smell it so i bring that with me when i travel if i'm just gonna be like going somewhere um i don't really keep it in my purse they have mini ones i don't really keep it in my bag only because like if i'm out and about i'm never gonna poop in, in a public place it's, it's the same brand as this so i saw that they had hand sanitizer and i was like that's so cute and the bottle is just pretty next thing i have it has some makeup on it is a mini lysol y'all with covid going on you gotta have all these things in your bag very important so i just have a mini one um if i'm getting an uber if i'm in any public place i don't know just you just never know when you need to just spray something down so yeah i just have this mini one to keep in my bag anytime i need to kill some germs all right so i have another hand sanitizer this one it's like makeup and dirty but this one's by germ x um just the original one I really don't need both of these in my bag but the other one is like my bougie one and this is the one that i just have on me all the time so ideally i probably would just carry one but this is just what was already in my purse so i'm just showing you exactly what's in here i didn't clean it or go through it so you got to just see the realness and then of course i have my mask this one is dirty because i just came home and used this all day um i prefer disposable masks i do have a good collection of like cloth ones and cute ones but to be real i don't use them because most of the time i'm running around i have on makeup so it's just gonna dirty that and then i'm gonna have to wash it i'd rather just keep this and throw it away right after that day um i feel like it's more sanitary it helps me to break out less because 
you wear it for that day and take it off and have the fresh one so yeah this one has makeup on it just a little it didn't get that dirty um but i like the black one so i just have a big box of just all black ones from amazon and yeah i just toss it and get a new one anytime i'm about to leave so now i have this little hand lotion this is just a hand cream this is by my favorite brand um so so de janeiro so de janeiro it's like a brazilian brand and they're popular for their body sprays i have a huge body spray by them as well in my room um and they have their bum bum cream they have a lot of good products so this is their hand cream i also like their chapstick but i'm out of it right now and that would have typically been in my bag um but it smells so good it smells just like the perfume or the body spray actually no they do have a perfume now as well and you can get all of this from sephora but not sponsored just a really favorite brand of mine um, and just with using so much hand sanitizer and just like alcohol products i feel like you need a cream my hands get very dry and we're in the winter season even though it is hot in la right now it was so cold at a point and i don't know i just i, I have to have something to moisturize my hands because they get so over dried from just constantly washing them putting on hand sanitizer like you just need something and i mean it's a hand cream but you can use this if you have your your elbows are ashy knees are ashy feet whatever like just on the go so it's a nice little size so along the same theme i have some wet wipes this is by wet ones and just the original fresh scent one i like these a little better than hand sanitizer because it really like gets in the crevices of your hand and in a way i feel like hand sanitizer you're just rubbing the dirt together i don't know that's just what my mind thinks i feel like hand sanitizer is more convenient or if you're like sharing with multiple people you can just squirt it it's quicker but if i'm like eating or i have to touch something or put something in my mouth and i want a thorough cleanse and i cannot like wash my hands with soap and water this makes it feel way cleaner so i always keep a pack of these i have like five more packs just ready to go when this is um when this runs out so yeah i always keep these in my purse as well also you can just like wipe things down this is perfect for the plane too i always wipe down my seat use the Lysol spray so get you some believe it or not we have a we still have a good amount of stuff to show you so next I have this little moisturizing lip cream well it's called it's by Laneige Laneige I don't know how to pronounce that but it's a very good brand as well um this is called the sleep lip sleeping mask it's in vanilla I used to use the other flavor in the pink bottle I'm not sure which one it was don't, don't think it was strawberry but it may have been but i like vanilla better because i love warm scents and just flavors and it smells so good um yeah it's just a clear like basically like a just a lip moisturizer chapstick whatever um and it just comes in this little tube the only thing i don't like is that you have to put your hands in it and when you're on the go and your hands are dirty i don't want to like dip my fingers in there but i just use hand sanitizer and i just try to use like the tip of my nail and just rub it on but um make sure your hands are clean also i don't like sharing this because i don't want everyone digging their finger in there but it's so good this really if you have really dry cracked lips this will do the trick because it's a lip mask so ideally like if you at nighttime i love just slathering this on my lips because when you wake up your lips are just so supple and soft but i also like just keeping this as like a chapstick if i don't want to wear lip gloss all day it's just a clear you know nice little it's like a bougie vaseline literally the same thing but more moisturizing and it lasts a lot longer like when i go to sleep it's still on my lips so it really is like a lip mask so i have a bunch of just miscellaneous products we'll start with this so this is my concealer you could see how faded this is because it's just constantly being tossed in my purse and i do need to um re-up on a new one but you can only get these from Ulta. They don't sell the Tarte concealers at Sephora. They sell other Tarte products, just not the concealers. Um, and this is in the shade Medium. So this is the one that I use daily. Um, even if I'm not wearing a full face, I just like to just dot this on any marks I'm trying to cover up. And I always toss it in my bag because of the masks. wait for this pass i live in the city so it's like so loud um anyways y'all yeah this is the one i like to use because we wear masks i always have to touch up areas on my face because it wipes off my makeup so this one is just the shape tape tart shape tape double duty beauty 
and I'm in the shade medium and I like to just keep this in my purse it's little compact and yeah if I need to touch up just dot that on and just blot it down I'll show you what I use to um like apply it so there's two products that I use to do my makeup this is what I actually use to do my makeup which I feel like in a sense it's not that sanitary to have to just throw in my bag um sometimes I'll just put these in a plastic bag because they also like dirty up my stuff that's why I have my hand sanitizer lid is just brown from the concealer um but yeah if i'm in a rush i'm not gonna lie i do just toss it in there and i'll just clean it i have like a daily just spritz cleaner that i always clean this with if i'm not doing like a deep wash um and this is by hourglass that's the actual makeup brand but i use their brush for it to apply my foundation and if i just have concealer i like to just use this to dot it on my face or i have my um Real Techniques Beauty Sponge. I prefer this over the Beauty Blender brand. I don't know why. I think the shape of it and the, it's just a little more, I don't know, it just works better to me. So these are what I use to apply my makeup and I just switch between it. If I'm more oily, I might just use this to just like dab and it just sucks up the extra oil. Or if I'm applying concealer, this is what I'll just blend it with. So got both of these now if I ever have like a big purse that's not you know how this is very tiny I'll have like a makeup bag like a mini makeup bag and I'll keep things like that in it like all my lip products brushes um concealer like I'll keep that in there so that it's in its own little bag but because I just don't have the space for that obviously they're just in there by themselves let's just speed through these because this video is already very long all right y'all so I have my edges toothbrush just to touch up my edges might split it out might mess up my hair you never know so yeah got this from the beauty supply store then I have this little tie to go stick because I'm a messy messy person I'm constantly spilling things on myself when I'm eating drinking whatever so I bought one of these recently because I used to carry them a lot and then I would lose them or they would dry out but this has come in handy a lot lately anytime I just get a little stain you just Rub that on there and it gets it out. Very important. Um, and then I have my lip gloss. My favorite lip gloss ever, and it's so cheap, is by NYX. It's the Butter Gloss and it's in the shade Praline. Praline, Praline, I don't know. Um, it's like a brownish color, but it looks so pretty over my lip, my natural lip. And um, I use two lip liners. This one's by NYX as well. And it's in the shade London. So again, it's just like a brown shade. And then this one I got in like a PR package. Um, I had never heard of it before, but it's in the shade range that I like, which is like brownish. So it's by Ace Beauty. And it doesn't say the color. Oh, called Be Peachy. So this is what I have on my lips right now. Kind of rubbed off, but you guys always ask me what my lip combo is. This lip gloss and like a brownish liner. Or sometimes for a more dramatic look, I'll use like a dark brown liner and blend it. But this is for a more, you know, just to overline and look like my natural lips. I do overline um just use these then I have this little roller perfume um this one is called good girl by Carolina Herrera it smells so good I recently discovered this I'm gonna put some on it smells so good and I typically carry Killian's princess in the roller ball version as well but I ran out of that and I actually got a new one today but it was in my Sephora shopping bag so I just to make this video authentic, I wasn't going to like put that in there. Um, but I, I go between this or the Killian and Princess for like my travel perfumes. Man, it smells so good. So feminine. Alright, then I have a little Listerine spray. And I usually keep mints. I don't actually have it in my bag right now, but I typically do have like Altoids or something. But because I have Invisalign, it's hard to like, and I like to chew on those. I can't really pop that in my mouth. You can legit just spray it in your mouth, in the back of your throat, freshen your breath. Little rubber band. I always need these in my bag. This and bobby pins, miscellaneous in my purse because you just never know when you're going to want to pull back your hair. So I have this and like a few miscellaneous bobby pins in my bag. Um, and then I have, these are like my last couple products. These little spoolies and you guys know I get eyelash extensions so I always have to have this on hand. Always gotta brush those lashes out, y'all. I have a little pink one and a black one, and I just keep this in the little, I have a little pocket right here, so I keep that in here. 
randomly I have some tweezers which is not something I typically keep in my bag but lately I've been having like just some dryness so I'll just be somewhere and just start like peeling it off with this which is very don't do that probably not sanitary but or if I'm in the car and just look in the mirror or if I'm out at someone's house I don't know I just have a habit of like picking up my skin and lately I've been having a lot of dry spots so I use this to you know go over it one last thing is my wallet and I'm in love with this wallet it is like my all-time favorite wallet because if you don't know I'm obsessed with cherries I have a cherry tattoo so when I saw this I was like oh my god and I actually got this on rebag as well I don't ever keep cash and if I do keep cash I end up just depositing it depositing it into my bank account like the same day I don't like cash because I lose a lot of things so this is all I have in my wallet I just have I'm not gonna even show you guys but I have my credit card my debit card whatever um I have a Starbucks gift card I had a Target gift card but I used it yesterday so it's gone I have some coins in the little pouch and then I have my oops I have my ID I would show you all the picture but yes I can see I have my little state ID and that is pretty much it like I said I don't keep cash and if I do it's gonna go into my account so yeah that is everything that is in my little Fendi bag um I gotta put everything back in here now but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was pretty long for just the purse haul, right? But I have so many things in this little ass bag. What's that saying? It's like, look like, look like weight, look lightweight, but I'm heavy though, or something like that. Little but mighty because she carries a lot. So hope you enjoyed this video. I'm a girly girl and this is for all my other girly girls. Hope I gave you some inspiration on things to keep in your purse. Or I hope this was just entertaining because I'm nosy. And I know a lot of other people are nosy. So, But yeah, like, subscribe. Let me know if you like videos like this or if you'd like to see anything else similar. Hope you enjoy it. I'll see you guys soon.